A stray dog is being treated this morning for severe burns. It's believed someone intentionally hurt the dog a few days ago and could be abusing other animals. CBS 2's Jasmine Veal is live at the Animal Care Center in West LA with an update on his condition. Jasmine. Rick, I can tell you firsthand, I just saw Fergus this morning. He is doing very well. He's responding to his medication. A GoFundMe page has already raised more than $10,000 in donations for his care. But the big concern right now is the fact that this abuse has happened to other dogs and the person is still out there. You good guy? Huh? Kisses? It's nearly breakfast time for Fergus, a happy and lovable one and a half year old golden retriever. If it weren't for the severe burns and bald patches lining his back, you would never know that he suffered through horrific abuse. Unfortunately, this not being my first rodeo with dogs that are like this, uh, it's terrible to say, but without a doubt, you're looking at some sort of a malicious injury that's been induced by some type of a chemical burn. You can see, you know, started on the head, and thank God he didn't get his eyes burnt, he didn't get his face burnt, or any. It could have been a lot worse. A good Samaritan found Fergus wandering the streets of Lancaster and brought him into the shelter there a week ago. A day later, the Southern California Golden Retriever Rescue Group was able to bring Fergus to Dr. Alan Shulman at the Animal Medical Center in West LA. Fergus. His injuries are healing. But what's alarming is that the Los Angeles County Department of Animal Care and Control says just this month, three other stray dogs have been brought into the same shelter with similar burns. You can see one of those dogs in this photo taken by the county. More unfortunate, the research has shown that they sooner or later progressed to doing this to people. For Fergus, he's now in good hands and happy as ever after enduring the worst, living up to his new Irish name that means powerful. And with so little information coming in with these strays, no reports have been filed even with the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department. By the way, Fergus is going to be available for adoption in about two months. Reporting live here from West LA, Jasmine Veal, CBS 2 News.